Hey guys, in this video I will show you the best Sova lineups which I find the most useful and use them in a lot of my games. And let's start on A side. This first arrow is gonna reveal anyone waiting in front of A1. Just stand on in the heaven, place your crosshair on top of this edge, on top of this wall, take your recon and you full charge and jump and you reveal release the arrow at the highest point. Area. Another similar arrow which you can use is you wanna place your crosshair on the corner of this wall and you simply full charge. Ahead. This arrow will reveal anyone on long and in front of long as well. When I am defending A side, what I like to do is this simple double shotgun. I just stand in this corner, look up and place my crosshair into this connection, like this. Then I free charge. Revealing area. Then I go down and place my diamond on top of this connection, like this. And you simply two charge. Standing ahead. And all together it will look like this. Revealing area. Standing ahead. I've gotten many free kills this way. If I'm playing as a tree and I hear them taking the orb right here, I just do this simple shock dart. I just aim in the middle of this square right here and I do double bounce and full charge. That way it lands perfectly in the back and can deal some damage to them. When I'm attacking, the best arrows are these. Firstly, you wanna get in this corner and now you wanna see this, the biggest spike. And you wanna aim at the top of this blue spike which is inside of it and just at the tip of it. And you take out your recon and you two charge. This lands perfectly on the wall and covers the whole side. And this is what the dart spots. If they've been breaking the choke dart, you can do from the same spot this one. You just want to place uh, the space between your diamonds on, on the mid on the top of this spike, or like this. You just place it there, are your diamonds, and you two charge once again. This lands on this roof. And this is what the arrow spots. You can also try doing this shock dart. You just wanna aim on top of these leaves, or below this top of the tree, right here. Right here. And you full charge and send there the arrow. And this arrow will spot anyone who is hiding here at the tree. Now I will show you a simple shock dart on the default spot. You just wanna stand on the right side of this metal thing, like this. Then you wanna look up and you see the biggest spike which is peeking out. And you just aim at the point and the top of it, like this. And you just simply tap to shock that. And this will land fast on the spike. Now let me show you a simple double shock that. Just once again stand in this corner. Now you wanna look up. And you want to place this hard line on this little dot, which is under where you want to place it, like right here. You want to, you will be placing it on this dot, like this, and you simply free charge. That's the first one. Then you go down, and you just aim at the top of this smallest, shortest spike, right here, and you simply tap it all together. It will look like this. You wait a bit and you shoot now. And this lands perfectly on the spike. On mid I like to do this arrow. You just wanna just wanna pick fast and shoot the arrow between this window. Like this. This arrow will find anyone hiding in tiles and anyone who might be going mid. Or if you just wanna get the info for shirt, sure, you just Aim here and you one bounce and full charge. Ahead. The arrow will land right here and find anyone who might be hiding on mid. All the way up, up to this top mid part. On mid you can also do this arrow at the beginning of the round. You just wanna aim between those windows and you simply full charge into that spot. Ahead. And this is what the arrow spot. He spots anyone who might be here at pizza and anyone who might be close at this wall gate. And you just, then you can wall bang these walls if he dares anyone spot it. 
Another one is you just want to stand in the back and you want to see the top of this and you just aim where this shadow, shadow of the roof is and you place your cursor right here and you full charge. Arrow is gonna land perfectly right here and it's gonna spot a little bit in the market and anyone pizza, spawn or these close corners. Another arrow which is very useful, you just wanna uh, aim right here and shoot there your recon. That way it's gonna reveal pretty much anyone who is holding close and also people who are in market. If I know that the enemies are pushing tiles a lot, I just play mid and do this shock dart at the beginning of the round. I just aim uh, to the left of this island and I one bounce and just left click. That way it's gonna bounce off the wall and land in the middle. And this is the this is the way where if you would peek uh, this shot, right you will definitely get damage for a lot. So I do this once and you can do free damage at the beginning of the round easily. If my team is going B, there are three arrows which I use. First one, you just aim at right this, here. at the top of this tree, at the highest point, and you full charge. Very simple, and this one is the, probably one of the best arrows, since it reveals most of the spots. Anyone who is here, market, and the right stairs, and also the whole site. There's another useful arrow, you just wanna stand in this corner, and you place your cross there at the bottom of this chimney like that and you full charge ahead. this lands on the bottom of the tree and reveals anyone backside and more of the of this line however it doesn't get you more info so this one is good if you wanna maybe use your ultimate on site and the third arrow is you wanna stand in this corner and you wanna find this wires and there is this little connection in them and you just aim below it and you one bounce and full charge this is one of the greatest arrows and it reveals anything right who is spot anyone who is spawned more of this area stairs and also market however it doesn't get you info if there's anyone in the line when you are retaking b side you just want to do your recon like this you just Aim at the tree and shoot there and then you wanna get into this position and wall bank anyone who it spots also this arrow is great if you wanna do it from uh, this market works the same way and once again you should combine it with uh, wall banging these walls if i'm in clutch situation and i'm on spawn i just do this arrow i just bounce it off this wall one bounce and full charge super simple and deals so much damage and can get a free kill as well if I'm defending B, there are two arrows which I like to do. First one, I just simply aim between those two bricks. And I jump and left click, like this. Anyone who already pushed in tunnels is gonna get spotted and it's hard to break arrow. So they would have to turn around and I usually spam with Odin or Ares this fall. Or if you wanna get more info, you just one bounce and full charge in the middle of this. And it lands uh, in front of tunnels and gets you info if they are coming short or if they are waiting here even. It depends if the arrows get broken or not. Also, if the enemies are pushing and I hear them, I, you can do this shock there. Just bounce it off this window. This is where if they are close to pushing, you can do it. It depends how you want to bounce it off. You can do it a little bit further. That way it's going to let more in the back. But you get the point this is also a great way how to deal a lot of damage to them and lastly there are these two new arrows that i've learned and they've been very useful for me if you are in 2v2 situation or 1v1 you can fake the other side and you just place your corrosor on top of this vent to the left top corner like this and you one bounce full charge ahead. the arrow will go all the way on a side and it, it, it even spots players if there would be anyone in heaven if they or if they are on site and it lands here and most of the players will think that i am close in front of a so they will all rotate and i get a free side and you can do the similar thing from a to b just stand in this corner and you want to place your crosshair above these window shutters right like this and you one bounce and full charge once again ahead. and it lands perfectly right here and it's a great arrow it not it 
it spots a bit of spawn market and also site and it's very believable that you are in front of b site and they will always rotate and you get a, and you get yourself really on a site and you can get yourself a great position when the spike is already planted what i like to do and if i have my recon i just shoot my recon right here you full charge and that way you can spam anyone through this wall once again and it gets everyone to spawn and to market or you can do it on the other side as well on top of this wall like this and it works the same way as that one once again you can spray through this wall now back to a side there are few more a few more arrows first one you wanna line yourself like this and you wanna aim below this right side of this window and you one bounce and free charge this arrow i do when i hear the enemies closing the doors i just do this shock dart and it gets me a, a free damage on them but sometimes even a kill when you are retaking you wanna do your arrow on this wall your recon it really doesn't matter but you don't wanna over peek so i usually do like do it like this and that's enough for me to get enough information it spots the whole side so the only two spots that you worry after that are under heaven and behind the generator and also uh, this long you can even do your recon bolt like this you just double bounce and full charge of this wall and it lands under the heaven and then you can spray and wall bank enemies under here you can however you can do the same thing on the other side as well you just double bounce and full charge on top of this like that it bounces off and lands like this and from the below you can wall bank that However, what I like to do is to shoot my arrow right here. You just full charge and shoot it there. And it once again reveals all the heaven and it, and it can get you more information since the arrow is here and it gets you and it gets further and even in this cabin. But not only you have to do your recon, you can also do a shock dart and it once it got me a few kills as well. Like this, you once again double bounce and full charge. And it lands on the top and if you hear them they are coming close you just do this and once again you can do it on the other side as well it lands it lands in the back and can deal damage to the guy hiding here if i am in heaven and i hear enemies plant there are these two arrows which i like to do first one is this simple one you just tap one bounce and two charge and it plants in this corner and usually when you are planting you will go this way so it can once again did a lot of damage to players or or you can try to doing this double shock dart it's a very simple one you just take out your charge bar line for the first one you place that l bottom left corner of the charge bar like this and you two charge then you go down and you place that bottom left corner into this red gap like this and you just press it so all together it will look like this and it lands behind this generator and can get a free kill for you and lastly there is this arrow which i like to do just stand next to this wall and find this steep area on this cloud and you just place your crosshair in the middle and you free charge and it lands perfectly on this wall and you have time to get yourself in heaven and then you can spray with it through this wall so yeah that's about the whole ascent guys hope this video was helpful and see you guys soon bye